First stated in 1777, Buffon's needle is said to be one of the oldest problems in geometric probability. So let's say you have a football field like grid with parallel lines equidistant from each other, and you randomly throw a stick on the ground. The question asks, what is the probability that the stick will land on one of the lines? It turns out the probability is directly related to pi. And a weird consequence of that is that you can approximate the value of pi by throwing sticks onto sets of parallel lines as long as the stick isn't longer than the distance between the lines. When the sticks are half the length of the distance between the lines is when it matches up most nicely. You just count up the number of sticks you chucked and divide by the number of times they cross the lines and you get a number that's approaching pi. In this actual example, the length of the matches and the length of the distance between lines is the same at 9 squares. There are 17 matches and they intersect the lines 11 times. So 17 divided by 11 is 1.54 repeating. And when you double that, on account of the matches being twice the length of half the distance, you end up with 3.09, which is pretty dang close already to the value of pi. And the more you throw, the more the number will get closer to pi. It's something to do with all the possible angles that the stick can be in and how that compares to the distance it can be from the lines. I don't understand integral geometry enough to explain it any better though. <laughs> so I'll tag a couple of my math creator friends to see if they might could. It's just kind of weird to find the circliest thing like pi in something that seems like it only has straight lines in it.